Am I the asshole? For crashing my wife's birthday party and taking her home. My wife turned 30 this week. I'm 26 M. We've always had a strong relationship and I love her so much. My wife has a best friend from childhood Jimmy 28 M. I didn't know him that well but this year we've gotten to know each other and have gotten close. He's my best bud and like an older brother to me in a lot of ways. My wife goes all out for my birthday parties and I love them. She's more of a stoic introvert so I thought it would be nice to throw her a surprise 30th birthday with just her and me and make it a special event. I wanted to make her a gift she would love. Jimmy's an incredible artist and for the past two months I've been taking lessons from them. My wife was curious why I was spending so much time away from home with Jimmy but I made vague excuses because I couldn't tell her I was making a gift for her. She's made a couple comments but never seemed upset. I told her a week before her birthday that I had made plans with Jimmy. I have a job with flexible hours so it's not uncommon for me to do it. She wasn't upset or anything. When her birthday came, it was all I could do not to say anything. When she left for work, I put my plan in action. I decorated the place. I brought out the cake. I learned from YouTube and stored it at her friend's house. I got a dozen bouquets of flowers. I got her a few other gifts too. She was supposed to come home at 5.30 but she didn't. I waited hours for her but she didn't come home. I called Jimmy and he said he hadn't seen her. I called her and she didn't pick up. I checked her location and she was at a restaurant. I went to the restaurant and she was there with her friends. They were eating a birthday cake and she had presents. I never met these friends of hers before. I think they're from her work. She seemed sad. She wasn't smiling or energetic. I wanted to take her home and show her my gift so she would be happy. I came over to her and told her she had to come home. We grabbed her things and left. On the Uber back, she didn't say anything. At home she started crying. She has been sleeping on the couch and she avoids me. My wife hasn't talked to Jimmy either. I told my mom and she called me an asshole. I don't know why. Am I the asshole? You're the asshole. You told her you had plans on her birthday and she made her own plans. When you plan a surprise, it's on you to make sure the person will be available. The plans she made with her friends were not less important than your poorly executed surprise. You're the asshole. You didn't use the critical piece of surprise party planning where you have her home at a certain time for a good reason. You just made it look like you were blowing her off, and she made other plans. You honestly just made it look like you remembered her birthday at the last minute and went overboard to try to make up for it. And instead of apologizing, you forced her to appreciate your thoughtfulness. Info why didn't you just join the group at the restaurant? And tell her there is a surprise at home when she's ready? Did you say anything in the Uber? Did she see the flowers decor and not say anything? How many days ago was this, and why haven't you apologized for not communicating adequately yet? You're the asshole. You tried to do something nice, but you went about it the wrong way. Surprises are often a bad idea. This is a case in point. You told your wife you wouldn't be free on her birthday, so she made other plans. You embarrassed her in front of her friends, friends who had taken her out for her birthday. Of course she is upset. You're the asshole. You've been sneaking around and giving her vague half excuses about where you go. The day of her birthday you tell her you have plans and will be busy. So she makes plans on her own, goes and tries to celebrate her B-Day anyway because you've been acting distant and aloof. Then you crash that and drag her away? The surprise wasn't for her it was about you. Look what I did look how awesome I am you made her feel like crap, for weeks, then on her birthday made her feel even worse. You're the asshole. I hate surprise birthdays where the main message is I've forgotten your birthday you can do surprises without that part. I don't know why people get such a boner for purposely hurting their loved ones before making them happy. You're the asshole of course she's going to be upset and why didn't you make an arrangement or a reason to make sure she came home? What is actually wrong with you? People were celebrating her birthday and you dragged her away? Not enough info. Were they work friends or something that you didn't know? You assumed she would be home but you also had told her you had other plans. She probably thought you were blowing off her birthday and made her own. Showing up and basically snatching her away from the group was also probably very embarrassing and rude. Sounds like the surprise backfired. Gonna lean you're the asshole here. Your wife is also allowed to do her own thing. You're the asshole. The way to do a surprise is to have a fake set of plans that act as a placeholder for the surprise. What the fuck is even happening with this post? You behaved really oddly I can't lie. She made plans because you didn't. 
you then intruded on her dinner with her friends who had all gotten her presents, and pulled her away. And what, you didn't even give her your own gift. At this point it feels like you've gone to all this the trouble for yourself, not Nair. You want a pat on the back more than you want her to be happy on her birthday. You're the asshole. Public service announcement A surprise birthday party is rarely a good idea. A surprise birthday with zero guests is never a good idea. You're the asshole you led her to believe that you and her best friend had plans without her on her birthday. How do you not understand that it would be hurtful for her? How dense can you be? So she, in an attempt to cheer herself up, made other plans, then you show up demanding she go home like some sort of Neanderthal. What you should have done is apologize and explain that you were attempting to surprise her and that it was waiting at home for her when she was ready. Then you should have asked to join her at the party at the restaurant. You have royally screwed up this birthday for her. Ew. I told me wife she had to come home. Op who do you think you are? She was having an amazing 30th B-Day party and you ruined. For what reason? I hope you know she'll never forget this. You're the asshole, a big one. Something tells me there's more to this story. Did you cause a scene? You're the asshole because you ruined not only her birthday but the weeks leading up to it. Yuck. You're the asshole. You tracked her location and then pulled her out of her at dinner in front of everyone because checks notes you had presents waiting for her at home. Why could you just delay your surprise? It was just the two of you. You lie to her for weeks about having plans, demand she leave her party with her friends, for the big surprise of, cake and flowers? I am baffled. Oh and obviously you're the asshole. Added it to add okay so you made her some sort of artwork that you could have just given her like a normal damn person and not made it all about you. Even more you're the asshole tbh. You're the asshole. She spent the day thinking you and Jimmy didn't care enough about her to organize a single thing for her birthday, and in fact actively made plans together excluding her, and you don't understand why she's upset? Then you compounded that by dragging her away from the celebration she felt compelled to arrange for herself? Added based on comments and when you got home, you didn't even show her her present? Dude. You're the asshole. Surprise events shouldn't actually be complete surprises, because people will think you forgot about them. You've got to at least drop a few nope, not giving any hints about your birthday plans, wink wink, or have a mini plan arranged in order to reveal the bigger plan. You're the asshole she's a grown woman and can make decisions for herself about who she wants to have dinner with. If there is a next time, find a way to reserve the surprise party time without giving away the surprise. You're the asshole I hope you had a good run of things cause your relationship with your wife is going to take a sharp downward turn from this point. You completely embarrassed her in front of her friends and you looked like a total abusive partner doing so. This isn't going to go well, especially if these are work friends and she sees them every day. You're the asshole if you're throwing a surprise party, you need to enlist people to make sure the person shows up as intended. There was no reason not to tell her you were around Jimmy to get art lessons. That wasn't a gift for her. BTW. It was a gift to yourself. You waited hours before trying to call her or Jimmy? The fact that she didn't pick up when you finally called should have been a hint that you messed up. All of this crap about her being stoic introverted makes me wonder about this marriage. You're the asshole you told her a week before you were going to have plans on her birthday with her childhood best friend. Her birthday you decided not not even acknowledge her birthday. You fucked up and yet you think you did nothing wrong. Her co-workers did something nice to make her feel special and you decided to crash it and embarrassed her by telling her she needed to come home. Them forcing her to leave her birthday party. Of course she would be upset. You ruined her birthday. You and Jimmy owe her a massive apple G. You're the asshole your wife made plans for her birthday BC she thought you didn't. Then you publicly humiliate her by showing up at where she was to drag her home like an errant child. On top of that, you GPS tracked her to where she was, like she was a child. Either a troll post or you're incredibly naive op. Still, you're the asshole. You definitely came off as an immature 26 yo in this post. The lack of communication, the selfishness of your actions, the fact that you can't even read your wife's emotions. She wasn't sad because of the other people, she was sad because of you hell, your secrecy probably led her to believe you were having an affair. Grow the hell up. Well yeah, you're the asshole. Start communicating better with your wife. You're the asshole yeah, she thought you hadn't planned anything for her birthday so she took care of it herself. And then you ruined that too. You owe her a massive apology and an explanation. You're the asshole. But at least she will always remember her 30th. Good job. I am confused.
Was she out with friends she didn't like or was she kidnapped? She wasn't smiling or energetic? What does that mean? She didn't want to be there with those people or she was mad you showed up? Not enough info here.